So I'm James Shaw, uh, 28 years old from California, USA. I'm a setter for Vivica Volleys here in uh, Hershing and sometimes officer. My father was a coach at Stanford University for 27 years, as long as I was uh, alive. Um, really came into volleyball when my sister was playing in club volleyball uh, when she was younger. And I really just love the atmosphere, I love the community. It's a really small world, and especially in America, there's not a lot of boys playing volleyball. And so we stuck together. And for me, this was the best part of volleyball, and this is how I sort of gradually became in love with in love with the sport and uh, really started to appreciate being a volleyball player in America. It's a unique thing. I try to avoid outside of volleyball thinking about the sport or thinking about how I played that day too much or, or what's going to happen tomorrow. I really like to try and get my mind off of volleyball as much as possible so this is important to me having some things to do in the free time. Right now I'm actually a professional writer. I, I do some copywriting and some creative writing on the side. I feel like uh, it's somewhere that I can see myself going in the future and, and pursuing and possibly writing some books, becoming even more of a professional after. Uh, I also really enjoy a lot of other creative pursuits like reading, uh, cooking, music. I love, I love listening to all types of music. Yeah, I have, a lot of, I have a lot of interests that I always pursue and I'm always sort of going down different different paths and avenues that I, you know, that, I, that I might find during the year. I love, I love Hershing. I've, this, is, this is my favorite place that I've played so far uh, in terms of just the, the, the surroundings, the environment, um, the people I feel like are really, really friendly and, and supportive of the club and of the players. And the weather is beautiful and, and living on, on the Amazé is like Second to none, it's one of the most beautiful places I think in the world. This is coming from somebody who lives in California who is, you know, it's always known as a really beautiful place. So I feel like Hershing is, a, is becoming a, you know, a nice little second home for me. It's, it feels like some, somewhere I could come back to and, and visit, you know, and, and be proud of um, having family and friends visit here as well. As a professional, I started in Padova in, in Italy and, and was a setter there. It was a difficult first year. We didn't really have a great, uh, a great season and I didn't really have a great season personally. And I thought, I don't know, maybe this is not for me. But I got the opportunity to be, uh, be a second setter in Perugia the next year, which was really fortunate for me. I got to play uh, behind De Cecco, which is, you know, he's one of the best setters in the world. Um, I got to learn from him and I got to learn how it is to be on a on a top team in the, in the world and uh, for me that was a sort of a game changer for me in terms of okay this is something that um, I can I can try and pursue. I got the opportunity to play in Poland in uh, for, for Zaxa one of the one of the other best teams in the world. After that I went to France as an opposite playing in Narbonne. That season was especially difficult because I had a couple of freak injuries and freak surgeries that I had to have and I had to cut that season short and then uh, actually, at, when COVID happened in 2020, it, it, my career again kind of took a turn. I, I got a chance to go play in Piacenza as an opposite. Uh, the season didn't go very well. We weren't really doing very well, and I was I was a second opposite. So I just decided, okay, this is not for me. Went home and I pursued beach volleyball. <laughs> so I played beach volleyball for a year. Uh, I met my fiance, and uh, I really enjoyed beach volleyball. Although uh, I knew that in the back of my mind I wanted to give it one more chance to try and try and come back and play professional volleyball and uh, got the opportunity to come back as, as a setter on the national team. And the national team has been really supportive of me throughout the whole process, just trying to um, keep me a part of things even if I wasn't uh, fully healthy or fully mentally healthy. And now, you know, having the opportunity after that national team season to come to come here and be in a, in a top league in Germany and and play for this this club in, in Hersching, uh, you know, I'm, I couldn't be more excited and couldn't be more happy as a setter here. So it's it's been a crazy journey here, but uh, I'm glad I'm here and it's it's been it's been a great season so far. I, I want to enjoy this every every single day and, and and dive into the process of just being being better than I was yesterday and really enjoying what I have to do today and. So far, that's been a really, really effective way for me to just have a lot of fun and enjoy the season and uh, 
uh, that's something that I wasn't necessarily thinking about in past seasons. Um, and so that's been a big difference for me this year is uh, yeah, just, just enjoying this whole process and, and being present every day. Well, I really, I really appreciate the, uh, the support and uh, thank you for, for everything that you've shown me so far this year. And I, I can't wait to see you, uh, see you all at the next match in the Audi Dome um, and see you the rest of the season. And hopefully we, uh, we keep fighting towards our goals.